for myself so I can actually, you know, do some better videos or play some better video games. It's from iBuy Power, as you can see on the box. They did already kind of pre open it, but left it all like it was. Let's see here. Styrofoam covers. Oh, interesting. The mouse is not in its box, but it's, it's probably been tested. They say they tested it, they tested everything about this. That. There's the keyboard. Get this out of the way. All right. So this box inside says Lee and Lee feel the difference. Land cool two mesh, born to personal limits. I buy power edition. More. Styrofoam fabric stuff, whatever you want to call it. My order receipt thing. Description AMD Mainstream Gaming Daily Deal. Oh my goodness. Let's see anything else in here. I don't think there is. The sucker's pretty heavy, it's like 50 pounds. Yeah, it looks like it was open. You um, you put everything, all the parts and whatnot, graphics cards, motherboards in here. So they probably had nothing. The uh, power put the case in this box separate, and then opens it up and built the computer and then put it back in. Or just had it. I hate it. Don't you hate when you do that? You, can't, you just had something. Seriously, disappears like oh brownies or someone. Says. Oh my goodness. Oh there it is. I covered it. My keyboard. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see. Always away from your body. With the knife. Use it. Put this back away. Like so. Put the knife down. Finally opening something. Oh, wow, look at this. Alright, so the power cord and the user manual user guide, warranty information, all that good stuff. Okay. Now, this is the tricky part. You just pull it straight up. Nah. Let's not do that. Let's do this. This like so. Turn it upside down. And then lift the box off of the computer. Box to the side. Now, lay this back on the side for a second. Take the styrofoam off. If you don't like something or you have a problem, just repackage it yourself and send it back. Now, this looks like it's the bottom. Oh, look at that, that's nice. Oh, 
Voila. Whew. This hugger is not small. Important information. Please read before turning on your system. Instructions for removing foam packaging from inside the system. Well, there's, there's packaging inside the system? Yeah, there sure is. High five, high five power gaming desktops ship with foam packaging inside the system to hold sensitive components in place and to prevent damage during shipping. We strive for your computer to arrive exactly as we built, tested, and packed it. But anytime you require help or clarification on the system, feel free to call our support line. All right, gives you the number. Step one, removing the side panel. First, loosen and remove the screws, keeping the panel in place. Okay. So the only screws I see are right here. I don't know if this will be the right size. We got in here. Radeon. Liquid cooler. 16 gigs of RAM. Hmm, this cable down here does not look very safe. fans up here in the front. We should have one more. Oh, this one right here in the back. Part of the liquid cooler. Alright, let's put this back on. Hold that one in. What was in the choice of the pen? It's kind of deceiving. It makes you think it like opens like a window or something. Well, it's got hinges and the screws on the other side, too. Alright, so remove the side panel. Step two, removing the foam package. Carefully remove the protective package from the, from the system interior. Please make sure the packaging does not snag any of the components during removal. Check connections. I did that. Please inspect the computer interior for any of those cables. Connections in front of the seat, any of these components. You may now install the side panel back and remove the power supply and IO shield warning stickers. Please refer to supplied 
quick start guide for more information. Alrighty. Oh, well, hello there. Look at that. Cover for the top is mesh. So there's plenty of airflow on this. From the front and the back, as you can see, the front is mesh. So there's no you know, blockages from the air going out. Um, there's airflow up here, airflow back here. You want to see the back. Here's the fan, some airflow, airflow, but this is the power, so the main airflow is here to the back, other than the fan. All right, well, let's plug this sucker in and get see how it goes and works. All right, this is Valheim uh, on my new computer. Um, let's test the settings. Graphics. I mean, everything's high and all the graphics are on. Okay. I mean, look at this. It's running smoothly. Look at this, so much better. Like my last, my other computer that I have here. Oh man, it wouldn't even run on the lowest settings. I was, it was ridiculous, absolutely horrible, trying to run this game. Um, but so this is Valheim testing on my new com computer, my iBuy Power computer. All right, I'm testing with Humankind video game here. So far, it looks like it's working just great. Sorry, this is a tutorial. But look at that zoom. Oh, dang, okay. Sorry, I'm reading here. Sustenance, security, and pleasure. Wonderful stuff, this simple tool. I'm just going to, this is a quick test of, you know, making sure there's no lag. And I don't think there is. Um, I don't think there will be with this game, but here's a good test for it. All right, for my final test, I'm going to do Frostpunk. For some reason, Frostpunk kind of lagged on me all the time. Um, let's just load a game that has a lot and see how it handles it. 
I mean, it looks like it's running very smooth, so. Oh, yeah. No lag at all. Look at that. It would take forever for me to scroll around before on my own computer. So, here are my final words and thoughts about uh, the, the gaming or the computer itself. Uh, I love it. It's great. It's nice and flashy and colorful. The one problem I had was the mouse that came with it. It's all light, lighty, uh, rainbow light colored and stuff, but it's so sensitive or double clicks or whatever. I can't figure out how to freaking click and drag or do anything with that mouse. So I hate the mouse for some reason. I can't use it right, whether it's configured wrong or it's just not working right. I don't know, but I hate the mouse that came with the computer. But everything else is great. Uh, so I just use my own wireless mouse and keyboard for cheap from Walmart, Logitech, whatever. I don't care. Um, so other than that, I'd say uh, A plus on the computer and uh, from I buy power, great. It's been working good. I've played for hours on Humankind, had no issues. Um, we saw Valheim. I mean, this thing is looking great. So. Well, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time when I do a tech review.